Hi, welcome to Draw Plans. Learning how to use CAD is one of the smartest moves you can make. Just look around you, everything you see started life on a CAD program. I'm Tom Norris, I'm an architectural designer and I'm here to teach you how to use CAD. Just watch a short video or two every day and very soon you'll be using CAD like a pro. So today we're going to look at how to switch uh, your model space, uh, space units from metric to imperial. So the default is generally um, imperial and I'm going to show you how we can switch between imperial and metric. It's pretty simple but uh, it's something you really need to remember uh, because uh, you're going to be doing it quite frequently. So if we go to file and we click on new that oh, we're going to open up a new page from scratch as you can see it's in the default which is in inches now uh, most of our drawing here in europe is done in metric so uh, i do need to switch so there's numerous ways of doing it but i'm going to show you the very simple way of doing it which is up here and it's called space units so space units just click system english and metric go to metric done so now we're in metric and we're ready to set up our printer so if we go to printer page setup this is for uh, printing mostly in europe in metric so if we go a3 a3 297420 we go iso a3 and we go 1 200 uh, and that works for me that's perfect this is in the UK this is uh, setting up for the UK so if I was in the US right now and I wanted to set up in inches what would I do well I'd go space units English okay and then I go into file page setup and we'd be looking at changing it back to inches uh, whatever it is you're doing so that's basically how it is so we're going to re we're going to do a recap now so we're going to start again so this is the default new page a new page from scratch comes up in imperial click on space units up here in the middle and sometimes uh, it'll come up slightly different I'll explain that in a second but English and metric English and metric very simple but sometimes you got to remember that this is a, a dropout or a pull down so what we need to be looking at is the one that says 1.5 1.5 if you pull the others you're going to have different choices and again you can access space units but I'll show you uh, we're going to access it from say we pull another one we pull this one click on space units metric imperial and english uh, that's it so that's how you do it so i'm all as me always um, uh, everything i do is in metric so that works for me um, another way of doing it is you can go format space units there you go english metric so you can have the choice use a drop down here use the little icons or go format space units so it's all about space units it's changing the model space and uh, it's changing how they work so you should have that by now but if you don't uh, then i think you might need to give up because this is a really really simple lesson english metric there you go. See you on the next lesson.